Hi, and welcome to activity one, monitor and analyze customer and user feedback. So the performance criteria we're looking at today is monitor and analyze customer and user feedback in accordance with organizational timelines. Uh, we're looking at analyzing data to make recommendations about changes to websites, and we're covering uh, the reading, the writing, uh, some of the oral communication, navigate the world of work, foundation skills, and all of the interact with others and get the work done skills. So when reviewing a website, you need to be able to monitor and analyze customer feedback. Feedback can come in a variety of forms, including verbal, text, such as emails, surveys, or forms. This information then needs to be collated in some way for it to be of any use. Verbal feedback must first be recorded somewhere so that it can be referred to later, and this could be a note that is kept with the text feedback. Text-based feedback needs to be read, and then all the text-based feedback summarized. Surveys or form data can be automatically collated in some instances, such as answers with numbers or a limited number of responses, uh, maybe multiple choice. Free responses will need to be read and summarized. Once collated, the feedback can be analyzed. This can be done through the creation of graphs and the consideration of feedback summaries. Organizations will have their own timelines on when this needs to occur.